Now we are looking at the vermicompost pit of ours. And uh, vermicompost, as I have already explained, is very important for sustainable gardening. Without vermicompost, you cannot get healthy plants and soil cannot be... The depleted soils, what is there in today's world, badly need vermicompost to heal and uh, to regenerate. There is a lot of uh, information available on vermicompost properties in the internet. Now we'll look at a section. I norm we normally throw all kind of biodegradable waste into this pit. This is a banana stem, drying banana stem. And slowly it will decompose. Worms will get in. And then this is a coconut husk. And then there is uh, some sticks and twigs and all kind of thing. And then the worms continuously generate the vermicompost and they drop it on the top, on the surface. So every day you can harvest about a bucket full. And if you dig in deeper, you will find worms. Let's get a real hand. The worms? Yeah. These are smaller worms, you know, bigger ones are deeper down. They work day and night and producing the wormy compost. We made the tank about one and a half feet tall and about two feet wide. With cemented floor underneath. And I kept a pot here to collect plastic junk that keeps creeping in somehow or other into the garden. And then here there's a coconut frond. And then more coconut husk. There's a papaya plant there. So all kind of leaves and sticks and twigs and garden waste can be dumped into it. And then the base of the tank has to be cemented so that when we spray water, it percolates and finally we get this vermi wash. It collects drop by drop. Now we have half a bucket of this juice here. This can be diluted 1 is to 10 or 1 is to 20 and fed to any plants. It's a, it's a nutritious drink for the plants. And it improves the color instantly. Now I'll show you some more worms. We'll dig them out. They're, they're very harmless creatures. They're not disgusting or anything like that once you get to know them and uh, they breed continuously and they are really the wonder of the nature and people have to harness them to overcome the coming fertilizer shortage and food shortage I recommend every city, every household, every farm to get into this vermicomposting immediately and the uh, Compost that comes out is the top quality. Just crumbles and dissolves. That's how it goes.